I just got in trouble at Planet Fitness again. Now, let me start by saying this. If Planet Fitness wasn't the only gym in the United States, it's everywhere in the United States, there's no way in hell I'd go to another Planet Fitness, right? Ever. But, for now, I got to keep my mouth closed because this is all I got. You know what I mean? For now. So, you know my gold shirt I like to wear at the gym, right? Got the back. See the back muscles. See the back muscles. Um, and then I have a thumbs up shirt, okay? So clearly, Planet Fitness is not my biggest fan, right? Especially a lot of people that work at Planet Fitness go to Planet Fitness. For some reason, I'm not their biggest, they're not my biggest fans. So, I guess this is what happens when you speak out against men who like to wear, um, uh, what do you call it? Um, spandex with no underwear or booty shorts or stand butt naked in the gyms or like to, you know, parlay up in the girls' restrooms. You know, when you speak up, when you, when you speak out against things like that, like I just did a week ago, um, these are the things that happen, you know what I mean? So, at a normal gym I go to, this girl comes up to me, and clearly she's not my biggest fan, because she, I remember a long time ago, she kind of gave me that vibe and a look like, I don't like you, you know what I mean? And uh, so, you know, I just said, you know, good deal, you know what I mean? Never looked at her again, walk out, never, you know what I'm saying, just keep it moving, you know what I mean? We ain't even in the same world. So, today I'm lifting, right? I'm getting a good little lift in here, right? She walks up to me and says, you can't wear that shirt, so either you gotta change the shirt or you gotta leave. Cause your nipple is showing from time to time. I said, my nipple is showing from time to time. I can't wear this shirt. But I wear this shirt all around the country and every gym I go to and you're the only person that's ever said anything about it. She said, well, it's in our rules. I said, well, show me your rules. She takes me over there to the rule book. So I was flipping through the rule book and then the manager comes out. And uh, you know, I appreciate his professionalism because uh, I was a little frustrated and I did voice my frustration. You know what I mean? You know, I don't cut curse in front of women, but I absolutely curse this time in front of women, um, in front of a woman, in front of multiple women. Um, you know what I mean? So I'm sure they're not never going to be happy to see me here again. Um, but, you know, we'll just deal with that when it comes. So, um, yeah. So he comes out and he's like, I'm like, yeah, so show me the rules. And then she's flipping through, and then a few other workers come up, and they're like, yeah, you can't. It's just only problem is your nipple is showing from time to time. So I say, you know what? I'm getting a little bit of size right now. You know what I mean? My, my nipple might be showing from time to time. You know what I mean? But I'm like, it's not. I'm like I'm out, and I'm shirtless. You know what I mean? Or something like that. So then the guy comes up to me. He's like, he's like, yeah. He's like, dude, no big problem. Just, you know what I mean? But we got to think about this situation and what I've continuously went through at Planet Fitness around the world if you go back to my channel, right? So then, then that makes this situation not as um, minuscule, minuscule, um, what, what, like minimal? I don't know what the correct word I'm looking for, but minimal as, as it is in this situation if you just look at this situation, right? So he comes up to me, he's like, you can't wear that shirt because your nipples are showing from time to time. Once again, I'm like, dude, I wear this shirt everywhere around the country that I go to, right? I, I feel like um, you're picking with me and that's, it's bullshit. You know what I mean? So that's what I say to see what the reactions would be. And, uh, you know, so I said, this is bullshit. You know what I mean? And he's like, I, I get it. I understand. But you, this is what I'll do. I'll just give you a free shirt. So just take the free shirt. Or, you know what I mean, change, take the free shirt, change the shirt, or leave. You know what I mean? And I'm like, you know what? I'm like, okay. So I took the shirt. You know what I mean? And uh, maybe I'll just start wearing shirts like this from in the future, bro. 
but they're gonna keep finding little reasons, you know, especially, I know they noticed my YouTube page right now, and uh, a lot of them know that I'm not their biggest fans either, you know what I mean? Um, so, you know what I mean? So, so they do stuff like this, you know what I mean? Especially women, I don't understand why I have, I'm having issues with the girls when I do nothing to women, you know what I mean? I feel like I'm the most respectful guy to women, you know what I mean? Um, but, you know what I mean? Um, like I say, when I do things like I've done like a week ago and they got mad at me for um, speaking out against, um, you know, men in the women's bathrooms, I kind of figured something like this might be coming, right? So, and it came very shortly, you know what I mean? So, you know, no problem at all. Change the shirt, finish the workout. But once again, you know, Planet Fitness is picking with me. And, you know what I mean? I, I, not too long ago, they picked with me because I had my shirt like this. Because I had my shirt like this while working out, right? But remember, girls can go in there with sports bras. So he said, hey, man, you got to put your shirt down. You can't have your shirt up like that. You know what I mean? So this is what they do. But then, you know what I mean? <sighs> it is what it is, man. Y'all have a good day. Just wanted to share a little story with y'all. We got to finish this load, man. All right.